Okay, hi guys. So I'm going to play again in the King of Virus Italian um, Netrunner tournament series. This is like the fifth time they are doing it. Um, the first round here, I'm playing with my friend Daniele. He's um, he's connected to me with Discord. I hope you can hear him well. I'm not sure. Last time, my friend was pretty quiet, but uh, let's hope for the best. So we already set up here. We start the game and look at our cards and then we have to wait for the official start of the round. So I'm starting here and Daniele you can say a few words I guess if you want. So hi everyone. So this is like the fifth tournament of uh, oh, okay, King ragazzi, of Virus. Scusate, prima, prima non vi sentivo. Siete riusciti a, a far set, tutto, Claudio, a selezionare i mazzi? Set. Yes. Ok, perfetto. <laughs> okay, so I guess we got a little bit of Italian flavor in here. <laughs> Some Italian spice, oregano or something. Now, this is this is strange. Sh should I manligan? <laughs> <laughs> With these decks are you don't know, right? Yeah. Uh, well, I don't know if you should because I don't see your cards. Yeah, 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 of course. <laughs> ah, I just keep it, I guess. Whatever. What's going to happen? El Marigan. Okay, so good luck, have fun, Daniele. And. and uh, uh, can we start, or did, did Claudio yet. say that we are ready to go, or. Do you hear me? Yes, 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 yes. I was uh, just typing in the general chat to to wait for the for the official start. Ah, okay. I, I I wasn't sure. Maybe the Italian Claudio sprinkled in here was about that we can start, but I I didn't know. Oh, it's it's in general from the. Okay, let's let's go. Let's go. All right. So I start the turn. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What am I doing here? Hmm. So let's draw a card. Actually, I think I'll have to change the microphone settings. Um, okay, so um, do I install another card here? This is an upgrade. Okay, Daniela, so I switch to push to talk because uh, sometimes I have to, I guess, uh, think out loud what I'm doing with my cards. Yeah. And if you hear that, that's kind of weird. I mute myself if I do the same. Uh, I have the physical button to move to the, the headphones. Okay. So uh, security testing and a flip switch going down. Security testing, I guess, will give him two credits per per run because one. the flip switch cost me one and not, and not zero. Uh, because the first job resource is uh, also in there, and you put, put the security testing first. Ah, because it's a job. Yeah. 
if you want, you can do it the other way around and give yourself a credit. Oh, the archer. I would have liked to see that one later, I guess. <laughs> How are we going to do that? Hmm, how am I going to do that? I want to install a Mustel and then um, I guess I cannot immediately res it, right? Okay. Um, actually, I guess I would have liked to install one of those cards on the Tranquility Home Grid. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, yes. If you if you would allow me to do that, <laughs> uh, I stop right now. If you want to, um, or one from server three or server four, I still move. No problem. Take also the two credits. Oh, maybe it's automatic because it's the first one in the turn. Okay. Thanks. No problem. Blue moose, oh nice, lovely. But I guess uh, it's not a normal deck that you have a lot of card in your hip. R&D still holding for me here. I guess it was a uh, was that the security testing run again. Um, yeah. I guess agenda. I guess he's right. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Nice one. Cannot afford that one. So I guess I'm not raising any. You got me there. <laughs> and now I'm worried. Now I'm worried. Uh, really? What what do you expect? Uh panty with one card. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that would be nice, yeah.
Okay. It's making some more money. Filter draw with Mr. Lee, which seems nice. Pretty old school, I guess. Then the blue moose helps him with his money. So he's pretty rich and he's probably staying that way. Mm hmm. I guess I want to get some money and some cards in here. Huh. Not great. I'm installing an agenda because I think I have to be fast here. Otherwise, I will never be able to win this because of his money setup. Um. Put Maryland in here. Let's see what he has. It's not a lot of breakers yet. Oh, the Demuchin contract. <laughs> nice one, nice one. Money looks good for you. Again. <laughs> Funny. Okay. Still a bit worried. Ah no. Uh, Eli 2.0. I did not. Did you not remember I drafted that? I think I. I, I thought it was a, 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 a Eli 1.0. I guess. In this format, I guess that's not so bad. What? <laughs> Just at the right time. Okay. You think so? Ah, okay, because of the data sucker. Wow, the money is, yeah, Timuchin contract, right? Yeah. Paying a six influence, uh, no matter your uh, your faction. The good old times. Hmm, what to do here, huh? I guess... Protect maybe R&D a little bit, I guess, I don't know. <laughs> you play another Temujin for HQ now, or what, what's happening? That would be nice.
Wow, 40 credits almost. And with your Mr. Lee, I guess you, you should find the breaker soon, I guess. I mean... Yeah. In this format, Blue Moves, if you don't play so, much, so many events, it's, it's still good. Eh? It still repaid its cost fully. Yeah, I don't know. I really need to find some agendas fast, I guess, and score for points. I don't know what else to do here. Cyberdelia, more money. Oh, some breakers coming down. to do here. Stall. Stall. Sneak that one out maybe. If I find like the biotic or something. Or the chiefs. Do you have a bath also? Because that would be nice for you. <laughs> Infinite money at five clicks. Yes, I did not. Uh, no, no. <laughs> ah, too bad. But uh, at least a cyber daily, so you get some money back when you break stuff. Oh no! <laughs> uh, but you, you make a lot of money when you, when you purge. So. Okay, this seems nice. I guess he doesn't yeah, have. People enjoying that time. Yeah. Guess he doesn't, doesn't have a lot of cards. <laughs> so I'm putting that one in here. Not installing. I want more money than he has, and I'm advancing it twice. So let's see. Let's see what he does. He needs four cards in hand. So that's one click down. If he doesn't draw two more times. That's right. Okay, I'm gonna res it. Ooh. Okay. Uh, let me. Yeah, sorry. That was expensive, right? <laughs> Maybe that one? That was, that would be, uh, be possible to break, I guess. Uh, so let fire the, the first. Uh, you can pay four credits. Eight credits also. One brain damage, what's one brain damage? That's hard. Yes, let, uh, let them yeah. fire. Okay, too oh, bad, no. too bad.
That saddens me greatly. I, I guess we might have we might have a chance. So this is an eye. Ooh, this will hurt him also. <laughs> This might be bad for you, okay. but you have the data sucker, so I guess. Okay, so it's ah, okay. So it's not compromised. Um. Uh. No, 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 no. Um, this doesn't make sense. Um. It's strain zero, but I can break it. It has no subroutine. Oh, right. Right. I charge my... and fire. Oh, that's not nice. Uh, oh, I really want... want to win there, and I turn encounter the Fairchild, I guess. <laughs> okay. Whew. Okay, of course. So is it? Uh... Yes. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, doesn't. It doesn't really hurt that much, right? I mean, it keeps you out, but. If it was, if it was a, a tear. Yeah. Would be a disaster. Okay, so yeah. Oh, this could hurt. Ah, unlucky there. Now I guess that the Bocada is quite safe still. So maybe just throw out some more agendas. Hope to score. Score them. Oh, this can be dangerous. This was a very dangerous move. Oh my. <laughs> the wind's on the table, guys. Here's an agenda. Here's an agenda. Here's an agenda. Here's an agenda. And there's another three pointer here. Okay, let's see what he finds. Ah, security testing, alright. Oh, this is tense. Draw is nice. All right, so I think I'm going to advance that Astro here. Oops. So you are a game point. That's not good. Maybe not. No. Oh. No way. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. So you have two more clicks, right? Four cards. Oh, <laughs> I guess he can get in. I mean, I cannot stop him. Uh, 
Junge, aber... Na, oh. yeah, okay, I guess that's it for him. He can steal it, but then I'm five points. All right. Yeah, that's a sad fair child. So not not that's not the macro to break all. Okay, one, two, three, four. So it's actually not really a point on resing it, but I guess I res it. Okay, lucky me. run so that also a brute in fire yeah okay moment of truth no, hush. okay yeah unfortunately you have quite a lot of money so successful run <laughs> are you using the flip switch no <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> One lead also. Nice. Let's let me. This way. Does this go the way? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I guess so. So, if I'm dead, I'm dead. You you're you, 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 you're not dead, but unfortunately, I put another agenda on the fl on the table. Let's fire it. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I really would have liked to fire that beta test into like a Fairchild or an Archer, but unfortunately I drew both of them. So, uh, what are the two cards? Uh, can you, can you read, the, read it all, please? Sure. Okay. <laughs> yeah, nice. a server two was actually also an agenda architect deployment test, and I had another agenda degree mill in hand, so I had put out a lot of agendas for you to steal. Unfortunately, you drew and did your stuff, and I was, but I thought I I did not have another chance actually because with your money, I don't know. One pod gate breaker, and it's not good. Yeah, it's fair green. Ah, okay. With all this money, it's it's still good, but you know. Okay. All right, let's do the other round. Yes. Are are you making the game now, or? Um, if you want to make it, I'll uh, I'll ask for the time. So I have decided to play um, Azla, as you just saw, from my two drafts as a corp. And um, for the runner, I have the choice between two wizards, right? Uh, the the wizard two has three blue moves and two. Uh, what was the command for the to see what, how many times do we have left? Oh, I don't remember that. Sorry. 
Um, and the other wizard has only one blue moose and one um, one Azops and not as great breakers and stuff like that. But he has a little bit of multi access with a nerf agent at least, and he has the devil devil's um, charms for the parasites and stuff like that. So in the end, I think I will, will go with the less good breakers and without a lot of blue moose and stuff like that and and hope to to do something with the with the nerf agent bec okay. so because plenty of time for us. because uh, the other one is really just uh, single access and r and d lock and i don't really want to play that i guess 32 minutes or what did you say 37 okay All right, good luck, have fun. God. I think I'm keeping it. Maybe. Just because I have the professional contracts, okay. which is like draw and money, right? And I don't don't think I have a lot of that draw. So I guess I guess I keep it. No ice. You you did not find any ice without the Maligel with the Maligel? Yes. <laughs> oh man. Okay. And uh, let's go. Oh, you found a little bit of money, I guess, right? Yeah, sorry. Doesn't make sense. I'll, uh, I'll take back the two the two dollars. Sorry. Uh, uh, did you did you res it? Okay, no, no, yeah, take take back the money. Of course, no problem. Okay, so we have MK Ultra in the bin. We have the professional contracts out. We trashed an Estelle for the wizard money, which seems like an okay thing to do. That's Proco. Okay, that's nice. Broke another time. Ah, oh, the Faust. I don't think I'm gonna use it that much. Mm. So this goes in the bin. I have six cards. So I guess I install that crap, right? Run R and D. Yeah, it's great. It's great. It's the best card. I never wizard. Yeah, there's, there's. A, I don't think I have scrub owl, so I don't think so. Hostile, yeah. Also, one bad publicity. <laughs> I'm gonna check R&D again. Spider web, okay. And I'm gonna throw out the Faust. Don't really want it. I mean, I guess I could have used it with a Devil's Charm, right? And also with Proco, I guess it's not that bad. So just probably the spider web as we just saw. Uh, 
draw two more times. Play the Corroda. And now the spider web. Yeah, it has three subroutines and a strength of two, three. So if I play the dirty laundry into the spider web, I have only three more credits. So that doesn't work. So I guess I let that one go and do the dirty laundry into RD. Oh, nice. Now at the return. I'm a coward. Ah, oh, you didn't fire? No. Okay, I always fire those. But I thought um, there was for sure like Jackson Howards in the in the draft, but I did not find any, so I assume there's no Jackson Howards. Uh, a bit of spoiler, I did not find any either. In all of my tries. Steal that one, run again. Put the pep tap worm oh. down. Okay. Did not purge, so I guess I gained some money there. Which is nice. I'm not big on money at the moment. So, putting the mimic down, checking a card. Okay, nice one. Running server three. Let's see what it is. Spider web, as I suspected. No, I'm not using it. <laughs> okay. Uh, so it has strength three. <laughs> so uh, it says, for me, it says four to match strength and fully break, which is not correct. So. One, no, yes, yes, one for the strength, three for the sub. -rate. Ah, yeah, right. Spiderweb is the um, boomerang attack. Yeah. Do I want to see another another ice? I don't know. I think I want to see another card. And there's the demolisher. And I think I'm going to throw out. This one can be nice for late game when you're on match point or something. And I really only want to run R&D when I sure know it's an agenda. Deja vu. This is not a possibility. I don't know. I think I'm still throwing it though. Two cards, okay. Well, if I play the Parasite now, how many Mew? I still have, I have only one Mew. Why did I install the Mimic? Man, I have MK in the bin. Hmm. I 
think I'm gonna install that. Ah, it has to be rest. God damn it. Okay, right, so on HQ. <laughs> it's an architect. <laughs> okay, <laughs> nice one. Um. No res. Lotus field. Oh, I should have looked at the card, I guess. Lotus field. Cost 5 to res. This is the one that also cannot. Cannot be parasited, I guess, right? If I remember correctly. Strength cannot be lowered. Yeah, code gate 5 to rest. Okay, damn it. It's good tech against my deck, I guess. Hmm. Oh no. Okay, so you break. Yeah, I uh, you can do that after I break it, right? So, I guess yeah, I have uh, to break it. The the old rule you have to do it before the encounter with the innermost. Ah, okay. So I have to do it the the resing of uh, Capricide. Ah, okay, the resing, yeah. God damn it. Okay. Goodbye. Put out a daily cast on a demolisher, and I guess I'm saving the parasite for the spider web for a surprise. If he puts in another card, I'm gonna parasite uh, devil's charm. That uh, okay, it's too late, but on the other hand. I guess I can vamp him down, right? And then he is in zero for the, for the. So I guess money is kind of important. He's on five though. If he has like a biotic. Okay, so I'm on 18, so I take all his money, this costs me 2, yeah. Hmm. 
ramp him for 13, right? And now I need, I guess, some money. Gives you one tag, I didn't remember it. No. Break. Uh, okay, I have to check. I have to bid the same, right? Yes. So I guess I have to bid also zero. Yes. You don't really want. Don't want to mess this one up. Okay, I guess that kind of worked as intended. But now my tap worm does nothing. You don't seem to be sad about it. Officially online. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that, that's a threat. Installing a card, to, a card from uh, from archives now is a threat. <laughs> yeah, it is. Yes. So now I can I sacrifice the, the vested trust if I need to. Play like the vamp again, I guess. Right? With the liberated account money. There's a boomerang, seems a nice card. There's two face downs in archives. I think I'm gonna take two credits here, no, two liberated, and see if he wants to rest that on the eyes. No, okay. Not the turret. Yes, nine credits, right? A biotic and uh, and a three-two, and he's he's done. He's he's he won, he's won. I really hope to find like oh okay nice maybe to find the nerf agent at any time soon. Ah, oh, there it is, perfect. So let's go ham on our own HQ. Okay. Right. Okay. I take that one. that 
and it also gave me like a credit because it cost yeah that makes sense check r and d Cider. Let's check HQ. No, no. I have one bad pop, so this only this one only costs me one credit. So this again. No, no. Break the subs. Let's see one more card. Rid of it. Now do this again. See his whole hand. Auto remote enforcement restore. Okay. Well, sorry, Daniela. Okay. Just, to, just to. Guard, Lotus Field, yeah, I've seen the Lotus Field. Heimdall, check okay. Check the archives. What, what's... I was an okay. When I saw, when I saw your idea, okay, I'm so screwed. <laughs> oh, yeah, well, um, I guess, especially when I installed that France of Fuego also, and then I have like a lot of credits the trash not only three but even more i mean i i, no, I did not plan to use the fuenzo uh, fuego but there was no other good pick in the fourth set of cards and i thought okay. i just you know at some point sell it to an asops or something but yeah also okay yes it's quite common asop i guess okay. yeah pretty much so we we finally made it <laughs> yeah to play yeah, played against each other like the second time or something in I don't know eight tournaments or so maybe. More or less, yes. Uh, let's return to the general uh, yeah. room. Well, good, good game. Uh, well played. Thanks for the game, Daniele. I guess he's already left, but I wanted to say that. Um, Daniel is a real nice guy and I really like playing with him, but unfortunately we never meet in the tournaments. On the other hand, if you if you meet up with a friend in a tournament, I guess it's always not the greatest on the other hand, because one of you is going to lose or, or you split, which sometimes in tournaments you don't want. You want two wins, I guess. So I guess all's good and um, yeah, see you in the next round.